I've been in Manila for 5-6 years now and I joined Mercator because I before when I moved here so I was doing modeling and Chelsea was also doing modeling at the same time she was just ahead of me in the industry so, so, yeah, so she was just a year and she got a few years ahead of me so of course, if you're new and she approached me first so we kind of felt good that you already know someone in the industry so when I joined MVP and I saw that she was there I was day one, she was one of those girls that I was talking to but of course, you don't know everyone but you don't know how to start a conversation so I'm happy that Chelsea she won and I'm happy for her and also that I'm happy that I've seen her grow as a woman and as a friend so I'm really happy so when, I, when she was announced the winner it wasn't just a win for her it was all the win for us so but when you know someone and then you see them it makes you happy I was happy Mm. It's not just black representation, it's really women. I mean, the, the only reason why I put that in is because I always get discriminated because of my complexion. And obviously, how many kids out there who have the same complexion like me that is also going through what I'm going through? So if I don't talk about it, who will? So I decided to, you know, talk about it. And when we talk about it, we're slowly educating people about, you know, what they can say and what they can't talk about and so on. So but even when people are saying that I keep saying the black girl, uh, you know, the, the black girl, the black person, a black woman, it's because I went through so much discrimination through it. And I'm in the position that people is listening and I can inspire and change. So might as well talk about it. But, uh, yeah. but uh, it's not just focused on the colored people, it's also focused on it's just focused on women's environment. Abandoned by. Yeah.